Hey everyone, welcome back in. We're gonna show you another Minecraft tip. This witch just spawned here, so you know what? I just finished doing a mob battle, mob fight, I mean, and that's why I have all these stuff, all my super stuff. So I'll go inside my arena and put them all away. But we're gonna be fighting one of Minecraft's dearest legends, and no, it is not Hero O'Brien. I bet a ton of people already thought that. But no, we are fighting the one and only giant. Yeah, you can't get him off of the thing in creative inventory. But slash summon giant. But the nothing's capital except this G in if I click the enter it'll spawn the giant but not yet he doesn't actually take damage from the head or blow the only way you could actually damage him is if you hit him in the legs if you're wondering about that you can use a command block or anything so these things don't happen I'll go inside my arena flash flash summon giant Beast. This thing is really beast. But there's one more bug. Uh, this is 1.9, just so you know. There's one more bug. He, he actually doesn't attack you. See, I'll show you. I'll get out a sword. Flash. Uh, see. see, he's not attacking him. He's not like a pigman. See, I hit him. He's not attacking me. He just walks around in your world looking amazing. There might be mods that make him fight and stuff, but not in pure vanilla Minecraft. Nope. Um, so you can only hit him for the legs that are below. So one sec, once this fire wears off, I can, I'll show Oh, whoopsies. <laughs> once the fire wears off, see I'm hitting him in the head. Nothing's happening. I'm hitting him in the body. Nothing's happening. But I hit him in both legs. So, let's beast the slime and then I'll get to the next thingamabob or whatever. Okay, I'll be right back with the code. Hey everyone, welcome back. Oh, whoopsie, <laughs> mid video, but. Um, an ender dragon just flew into the distance. Mainly because I don't know how to get rid of him because peaceful doesn't kill him. Or her. Okay, so the command for it is control V. What is the wrong button? Control V. This is how you kill um summon the ender dragon. I'll do fly. Enter. And it's just like a boss. But my computer itself is laggy. Usually it moves normally, but this completely glitches out because see I'm glitching out so much because this computer sucks. One just flew into the distance. I know they move. Move. Yeah, see? He's moving. Why are they always going go Oh yeah, they go north. E Compass. This is again 1.9, which is actually also this, okay, so, mm, okay, so they're going that way, and slash, um, I'll do 10, 100, I don't know what that number really does, but, like in a mob battle that just made it tinier but more health so that's how you summon the ender dragon like a boss i would do it on my good computer but it doesn't have a recording set up i'm getting that so it'll be less laggy but that's how you summon the ender dragon <laughs> you still didn't get a good look at him summon ender dragon stop getting away I'm pretty sure the only way we'll ever get a good look at him is if we go to the end, which I am not willing to do. So that's how you spawn the Ender Dragon. I will be right back with the next Minecraft tip. 
Okay, so next Minecraft tip on spawning. Um, lots of people have wondered how to get the wither. Skeleton, not the wither. But, like this dude here. He's burning because he's not in the nether, but... How do we get you? Well, he gave me a little bit of information, and it is... This code. Pause if you have to. But I don't understand why there's a one here. He <laughs> just copied and pasted the code. Oh, whoopsies, whoopsies. Uh, type 5? Type 5 is a normal skeleton. Without a bow. And the wither skeletons don't hold their awesome sword. Unless I give it to them. E. Stone. Are they like zombies? Do they pick up, pick stuff up? Come on. Pick it up. I thought we were friends. No. Except this. Okay. So I can't even get a good aim at him. You know what? I'll set up a contraption to do it. Okay, I'm back and let's see if I throw this in here. Pick it up. I have to move you there. Come on, buddy. Does the big man do it? Why don't you? <sighs> Fine. I'll be back with the next spawning tip. Oh, wait. You might not have. I'll try this one more time with number two. Why is it white unless I do number one? Uh, slash 100 or whatever. The more number the pillar he gets, you're going down with wood. I mean stone. So, I'll be right back. Okay, and now I'm going to show you how to spawn the... What's the other boss called? Gar Elder Guardian. The, well, this is the code. The normal baby one you can get from the creative inventory. So, enter. Oh, <laughs> oopsies. I kind of put two slashes. Enter. See, that's the Elder Guardian. But... He can't steal weapons for you, like inside the dungeon. If you want him harder, you change. The I've tried this before, actually, and so this one I've tried. N number five, uh, that makes it the max powerful where it steals the weapon. Then is the most crazy. But he's very easy and gets owned in a few shots. Mainly, probably because I had my super sword on when I was fighting him. See, he died that easily. With a stone sword. Remember, I'm using a stone sword. Well, he does drop sponge. Which you can't get anywhere else. And there's one more thing. Uh, why can't I fly? Flash. Uh, go here. One, two, three. I didn't mean to do thousand. I meant to do. Uh, see, this one, the mini one. I don't understand. But they're crazy. It spawns one of the mini ones, but... Get back here. I think once it reaches like a climax of numbers you can't like it goes down the levels. Eh, I'll just forget about that. So if you're gonna ma want to make him as strong as he can be, turn the number into five. See, but instead of this, turn it into five. I did have a mob battle uh, with this. So next, oh yeah, the mini one. E, you can get him from the creative inventory. It's this one. A 
Okay, this is. I want to see if Beastful kills him. Like, Beastful doesn't kill the Ender Dragon. Yeah, it kills him. He's gone. So, yeah, I might have another tip. Actually, I'm running out of time, and I think I've showed you a ton of spawning. So, hope you enjoyed this video on how to spawn a ton of stuff in Minecraft using codes. Um, remember, this is completely vanilla. No code, no nothing. So, this is... And anyone can do this, but it's 1.9. And, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. I know I'm forgetting something. Oh, yeah. Um, none of these codes will work unless you open the LAN and cheats allowed on. I can show you because my cheats are already on. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this video. So, yeah. Bye.